JJJ, you already know it's your boy Joe back at it again, man. Codingface.com, man. Listen, your boy is back. I'm out here, man. All right. So this is what we're going to do, right? I'm going to save my video. And then from there, somewhere in between the middle of the video, I'm going to actually give out a free course to somebody, right? Maybe one or two people is going to get a free course on this video, right? And we're going to do it straight from here. Random generator or, you know, number generator, right? There's 200 people who signed up, you know, and then now I'm just going to let Google figure it out who's going to win because it's too many people. I thought it was going to be like, you know, a couple of people and maybe I could help out. But now, to be fair, we're just going to do it super random. Let Google handle it. You know what I mean? All right. So, anyways, so people have been asking me, Joe, how do you stay real? How do you stay just you know grounded and focused well very simple guys number one i don't act like i know everything like that's the first thing that you gotta know because you're gonna bump into people who are in this industry who they swear they are fucking geniuses like they think they are the second you know coming of christ they think that they they're the smartest person like they figure it out like they figure something out that nobody else figured out and I'm like, come on, bro. Like, stop acting like a freaking asshole, right? So, yeah, man. For me, what I do is I just stay grounded. I act like I don't know anything. Like, I'll be honest with you. I'll be like, hey, this is what I do. Like, this is a situation currently that I'm going through. There's a older developer who's been around for way longer than me. and But this person doesn't know everything that I know about. Uh, Laravel and you know and other frameworks right because they've been around for a long time but what do I do I try to tell them hey listen let's try to follow the Laravel way let's try to do things you know how the framework wants you to do it but this person wants to do it the PHP way which means just hacking it yes you know PHP yes you've been doing this for a long time but you're not following the things that the you know the framework is telling you laravel already has a lot of things built in you don't need to freaking recreate the wheel right so what do i do right i'm trying to tell this person to do this and follow the way this person doesn't want to listen to me so what do i do i'm like okay cool you're smarter than me i just leave it at that you know what i mean like i'm not gonna be arguing with this person and keep on telling them hey man Let's do it this way. Come on. This is going to be better. It's going to be easier. I'm just going to let them trip on themselves, you know. Let them trip on their own shit, you know. And that's how I am. I'm super humble. I don't act like I know everything, guys. I really don't. Like, if I know something and I found out a shortcut to something and I give you an advice, listen to me because when I give an advice, it means I went through something. I went through uh, a mistake. And basically, when I tell you to do it a certain way, it's because I already went through that mistake. And I already, you know, already been through it. You know what I mean? So that's how I stay humble, man. I don't act like I know everything. I don't act like I'm the smartest person in the world. I don't act like I'm the best programmer. I just want to be, you know, somebody who's just cool, somebody who, you know, is a good co-worker, somebody who is able to work with anybody, somebody that, you know, I could just be fucking in a good mood all the time. Even when I'm feeling sick and tired, I still show a face of like, hey, let's get it on, man. Let's let's get hype. You know what I mean? Because that's the type of person that I am. And for you guys, my advice would be is, listen, when you work in a certain environment, guys, don't, even if you know more than the other person, don't act like you know more than the other person. Be humble. You know, just be yourself, but be humble. You know, don't try to shit on the other person because you just look like an asshole. You know what I mean? Like, you look at those guys, you know, Elon Musk, you look at uh, DHH, you look at Mark Zuckerberg, you look at freaking a whole bunch of developers who, who pretty much have made it really big. They never really showed up their skills. They just go into work and do their thing that's it you know what i mean like they don't have to show off and act like 
they're the best. They just they do their work quietly, get it done, and let the work speak for themselves. You, you know? All right? But anyways, man, I know you guys have been waiting for this, man. You guys have been waiting to find out who's going to win out of the 200 people who signed up, right? Well, very simple. We got to do this, like, pretty crazy right now. We're going to search random number generator, right? And pretty much, let's see what it gives us. Number six, all right? Nah, <laughs> I'm joking, guys. Yeah, don't get scared. I know how to do this, man. Don't get scared. All right. So the minimum is going to be a one, and the maximum is going to be 200, right? So let's see what it gives us. All right. I hope there's somebody who always comments, man. I really do. Number 10. 81. Okay, so 10, 81. One more. 110. All right. 10, 81, 110. That's the winners. And I will tell you right now because I have the list, but I cannot show it because if I show it, then everybody else's names and emails is going to come up. I'm pretty sure that you guys don't want that information to be out there because if you signed up for my, you know, my gift to you guys i'm pretty sure you guys don't want your email roaming around the internet and stuff right so let's get it holy shit man all right so alan and guy uh he won but i'm amazed right now my boy joseph and this is not like nobody cheated nobody did anything this was straight to be honest with you guys. You saw it. It was completely random. I cannot show you the list because, you know, I don't want everybody's emails to be on the internet. But, listen, this how this how fucking real it is right now, man. This how real this thing is, man. This kid Joseph been around since, like, when I had less than 100 subscribers. And you see how karma is? The first time that I start giving this out, he's one of the winners. And, like, I'm not even lying. I know people's going to be mad, this and that. But the truth is, that's how karma is. Dude always show me love over here. Been around since the beginning. And look how God just comes in and sprinkles a little something on him. You know what I mean? Listen, I'm just happy for him because, like, you know, you know what it is to be here from when it's under 100 subscribers. And then now we're up to 2,000. And then you freaking win. You know, it's crazy. And then you got your boy Simon Siamion Ranzel. I don't know how to say it. Uh, it sounds like uh, some uh, some Russian shit. I don't know. Um, but yeah, you guys are the winners. Now, all right, man. So I have to be fair for everybody. You know, if you guys don't contact me from now till tomorrow at 9 o'clock, 9 p.m., Eastern time. If y'all don't contact me before that time, you forfeit your course, and then it'll go down to Abdo for one, Matthew Pickerings, and Flint Mayers. All right, it's that simple. So make sure you watch this video, and make sure if you won, contact me and send me an email saying what course you want to take. All right, and it has to be programming. All right. <laughs> I'm not going to give you a course about how to cook or some shit like that. This is for programmers. If you send me some crazy shit like that, you forfeit your thing automatically. <laughs> All right, guys. I'll see you later. Bow.